This is the case of a patient with ischemic cardiomyopathy implanted with a CRT device. We found in the memory of the device an episode of VF diagnosed via the combined count. So the aim of this tracing will be to explain the functioning of this specific counter, the combined count. This is the plot of the episode of VF diagnosed via the combined count. You see first a normal rhythm, then an acceleration with a clear ventricular tachycardia, dissociation between the ventricles and the atria. You can see also that there is a fluctuation in the cycles between cycles in the VF zone and in the VT zone. Here the initial detection, then the burst. The burst is successful with a return to sinus rhythm. In Medtronic ICDs, the device counts VF and VT events separately. This may delay the detection, like in this example, a ventricular arrhythmia fluctuates between the VT and the VF zones. So this is why the combined count has been designed. It is non-programmable, means that you cannot switch it off if a VT zone has been programmed. And the combined count is automatically enabled after the detection of six ventricular fibrillation events. When we look at the EGM, it's clearly a ventricular tachycardia with more ventricles than the atria. And you can see that there is a fluctuation between cycles in the VT zone and in the VF zone. As explained before, the combined count will be unable after six cycles classified as VF. So the combined counter will sum the cycles classified VT and VF. So from here to when the counter is reached, you can find 35 cycles classified either VF or VT. So why 35 cycles are required? The combined count is always 7 sixths of the initial number of intervals to detect a ventricular fibrillation. In this patient, it was programmed as 30 out of 40, so 35 is the 7 sixths of 30. Once the combined count has been reached, there's going to be an analysis of the last eight cycles before the diagnosis. If all of these eight are classified as VT, it is going to be a diagnosis of VT and the first therapy for VT will be delivered. But if, like in this example, at least one of the cycles are classified VF, it is going to be, like here, a diagnosis of ventricular fibrillation and the first therapy for the VF zone is going to be delivered. Here it's a burst before charging and we see that the burst is efficient.